Hello team, welcome to KSR Data Vision. Uh, today we are going to meet Mr. Prasanna Anjanelu who got selected as a business analyst with the Landmark Groups which is our tie-up company. So we will take few input from him like uh, how he succeeded and how he got a job as a business analyst and uh, what his struggles and being an electrical engineer and uh, how he transformed his career as a business analyst and as a data scientist. Or. So he's a role like a business analyst but uh, he completed course in both business analytics and data science combination from the KSR. So we will take a few inputs. Maybe it will motivate other people who want to start their career as a data scientist or a data analyst or business analyst. Uh, hi, Prasanna Anjanelu. First hi, of all, sir. congratulations for selected as a business analyst in our landmark groups. Thank so, you. So, how it's feeling? Yeah, <laughs> actually, it was a long journey from, although it is a six months period, but mm -hmm. it is very a very long journey for me mm -hmm. because I moved from my hometown to yes, the yes, end yes. Uh, so, so just to give in a small brief about you from your uh, childhood onwards means and, uh, when your graduation completed and from which college and, uh, and which stream. Yeah, sure. So myself Prasanna Nehru from Guntur Andhra Pradesh. Mm -hmm. I am from EC, um, uh, EC stream, Electronics and Communication Engineering. Okay, okay. I completed my bachelor's under Jawaharlal Nehru Technology University mm -hmm. at Nasrapur Institute of Technology. Okay. So I completed my 10th uh, class in 2014. Mm -hmm. During mm -hmm. summer 2014, my father passed away due to brain tumor. Oh, okay. Uh, Sorry. After that, mm -hmm. uh, I couldn't go to college uh, for two years. Mm -hmm. And I joined intermediate again in 2016. So, sorry, so after 10th class, you go, had a career gap for two yeah, years? and uh, two okay. years education gap. Mm -hmm. So this two years education gap was not a big problem during my intermediate. Mm -hmm. so, uh, it was only in a BTEC third year when the campus day started. Okay. It was a big problem because most MNCs, they will consider only education gap is one year. Oh. So above one year, they won't consider uh, applications from uh, students. Mm -hmm. So because that the main reason I couldn't get placed in any, in any campus days. Mm -hmm. So uh, after complete, uh, during my third year, around some, somewhere around second, third year, mm -hmm. one of my friends became a data scientist and okay. uh, I got to know what data science is. and. Some understanding about this field and mm -hmm. I got interested. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm. So I kept this one as a secondary choice because in case if I don't get placed in uh, any campus days, I thought about uh, coming to this field. Mm -hmm. But as you can see, this became a mainstream for now. Uh, mm -hmm. Okay. Uh, and which year you passed out? 22 or 21? Yeah, in, in June 2022. 22 my you is finished. Yeah. Okay, okay. So yeah. uh, how you got to know about data science and the KSR? About, uh, about KSR, uh, I told you uh, one of my friend's brother became a data scientist. Mm -hmm, so mm -hmm. he was okay. trained from uh, KSR data vision. Okay, okay. mm -hmm, uh, it was his referral. I came here and okay, okay. even before joining the course mm -hmm. for enrolling this data science course, mm -hmm. I uh, asked KSR team about whether my education gap is going to be a problem or mm -hmm. not. Mm -hmm. So the team told me clearly. If you are hard working and you got skills, it won't be a problem. Mm -hmm. We will recommend you to our one of our. Uh, Tie up companies, mm -hmm, so mm -hmm. they kept their promise. And I actually, <laughs> yeah, uh, I was uh, moved. To, uh, I moved to here uh, in October mm -hmm, because mm -hmm. my second problem is my communication. Mm -hmm. I, uh, at that time, I couldn't explain. Mm -hmm, my, and mm -hmm. although I have some skill, I couldn't explain myself clearly. Okay, okay. So for that reason, uh, the key team offered some uh, mm -hmm. classes, communication classes, mm -hmm. uh, come to institute and communicate with people. Mm -hmm, that way, mm -hmm. your communication will be better. Mm -hmm. So I moved to Bangalore uh, in to October. Uh, every day at 6 p.m. Uh, we used to gather around in the institute and talk about um, our course and uh, mm -hmm. expressing ourselves. That okay. my kind of a group discussion yeah, you are handling daily. Every okay. day mm -hmm. for one hour. Okay. That helped me improve my communication way better. Okay. How your practice is happening on every day, every day to day basis? Like how you are practicing to cry the interview? Yeah, actually, uh, after stat uh, statistics, mm -hmm. uh, right after Python started, mm -hmm. Odisha used to give uh, re regular assignments. Like mm -hmm. that, uh, every, day, every time he, do, he taught us some stuff, and uh, he used to give assignments in a different stuff, like mm -hmm. uh, advanced. Mm -hmm. So, uh, this is to monitor the performance of the student, like okay. uh, the thinking mm -hmm. capability and the, whether he is, can. He can fit into IT department or not because mm -hmm. you know most of the job workers in IT are mm -hmm. based on they code you based on Google only. Okay, so okay. how efficient in my second one also uh, the interviewer asked me, I want to see how you will Google this uh, okay. this problem. They give an opportunity to check in Google. Yeah. Okay. They, okay. Uh, <laughs> they want to check uh, even if I have okay. technical knowledge, don't mm -hmm. have technical knowledge, mm -hmm. they will see about how he can have how fast you can search and you yeah. can resolve the issue. That uh, okay, good, good. Yeah, mm -hmm. that way the, the team trained me in uh, 
ஒரு <laughs> 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 so uh, to help my uh, crack my interviews it was mainly focused on sql as the, most of the data science will be working on python and sql most mm-hmm. so uh, 50% of the focus will be on sql and okay. uh, 40% will be on python and the mm-hmm. other about domain knowledge like okay. uh, how much we can understand about business and all business terms and mm-hmm. uh, everything and the domain knowledge is very important one of the key aspect in my second round mm-hmm. what round, are the major concepts in the domain knowledge you gained here the knowledge about inventory management first of all okay. managing the inventory of the mm-hmm. company mm-hmm. and the other one is customer value management like uh, yeah mm-hmm. so thing is uh, most of the people they are not concentrating thinking is and just in a uh, basics and yeah, knowledge yeah. or else we are looking at vendor management or else yeah. uh, supply chain management or else ivm yeah. so uh, it's a 50% valued for it to crack your interview yeah second one is mostly this uh, business round only so mm-hmm. um, if you have only technical knowledge it will be it will be helpful in your first round only okay for, for cracking the first round you need sql and python and mm-hmm. some mm-hmm. knowledge about projects like mm-hmm. how much practical knowledge you have about in the domain mm-hmm. that will, they will consider all technical round okay. it will okay. be like okay and the second one is mostly half half will be technical round and half will be your on domain knowledge skills. and general knowledge okay okay and uh, most into the business case studies yeah case yeah. studies so they are definitely. expecting okay yeah. so here you focus more into the retail related projects yeah, which is relevant okay yeah. okay so apart from this did you attended any other interviews in earlier and means no 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 uh, here on yeah, before in the campus only you attended but it's not yeah. uh, going uh, to actually i didn't came to interview itself uh, mm. while well, uh, submitting the application mm-hmm. they saw my education gap of 2 years na no? okay then what they did uh, i know uh, your resume cannot be shortlisted they said they used to send emails like that okay, okay. yeah okay. that was mm-hmm. the main problem but after here you got okay yeah. with the package of 7.5 7.5 good yeah. good Thank congrats professor on what time all the best for your future thank you